A while back, we had explored DeepSight, a hugging face spaces app powered by DeepSeek R1 and V3 models that lets you generate basic web apps and UI components completely for free. It did a surprisingly solid job, especially for something so accessible. However, DeepSight had a few limitations, mostly notably with its strict rate limits, no options to host your apps, and the use of older DeepSeek models. That's why today, I'm excited to introduce a powerful local alternative that is similar to DeepSight called LocalSight AI. This is something that's designed to replicate the DeepSight experience, but with far greater capabilities. LocalSight AI gives you full freedom, full local execution, and access to newer DeepSeek models alongside the support for multiple model providers and even thinking model integration for smarter app generation. If you love what DeepSight could do, you're going to be blown away with what LocalSight is capable of doing with zero restrictions and more flexibility. You have the power to create various sorts of applications completely for free, and you can see the quality of output that you can get from local site. This is thanks to the new DeepSeek R1 0528 release, as well as the DeepSeek V3 model. These two models are now powering local site as well as deep site. So it is gonna be exceptional in terms of code generation as you can see how well it performs against many of these other proprietary models like even Gemini 2.5 Pro, O3, as well as Quen3. You can see the type of performance that you can get where it is sometimes beating most of these models on par or slightly just a little behind in comparison to these other models in terms of both of these two different models. But in short, Local Site AI is a local powerful alternative to DeepSight and if you use DeepSight, you're going to be able to see that it's exactly the same. Just a couple of different UI components that are a bit different. You can see there's working steps that would be displayed to showcase the generation live in action. You also have it so that local site has the ability to have it so that it could be powered with local LMs through Olama as well as LM Studio. And then you can also use other providers to power local site. So you can use something like the OpenAI compatible APIs, or you can even use Gemini models if you would require to. This is something that is open source and customizable, so you can easily get started right away. And you can see that the quality of output is exactly the same and similar to how DeepSight is capable of outputting things. Before we dive in, a quick shout out to today's video sponsor, Type AI. If you write anything, whether it's a newsletter, project briefs, blog posts, or sales copy, you need to check out Type. It's not just an AI tool, it's a full writing workspace powered by powerful models like Claude as well as OpenAI. Type is the only all-in-one writing assistant that combines AI document generation, editing, and chat all in one clean modern interface. So whether you're brainstorming ideas, writing your first draft, or polishing your final copy, Type helps you do it faster and better. Their brand new autocomplete feature is absolutely insane. It's like having your own personal AI copilot that finishes your sentences, suggests paragraphs, and speeds up the writing process without breaking your flow. Just simply use the slash command and watch the magic happen. But here's the real kicker. Type can actually write in your voice. Upload a writing sample and a background doc, and it tailors the content to sound like you. Not generic AI fluff, your tone, your knowledge. So if you're serious about writing faster, better, and more like you, head over to type.ai with the link in the description below to start your 14-day free trial today. Your blank page just caught an upgrade. But with that thought, let's dive right back into today's video. And guys, there's nothing wrong to use DeepSight. It is something that is still partially free, and it's just something that is rate limited. So if you want, you can still use it off of a hugging face basis and still get remarkable generations. The only reason why you would want to use local site is so that you can use a local model and then have it so that you don't need to pay for the API costs with Hugging Face. Now to install local site, it's super simple. You're just going to need to make sure you have the prerequisites fulfilled. Make sure you have Node.js installed as well as NPM. And you're also going to be needing uh, Olama or LM Studio if you're going to be using a local model like the distilled DeepSeek R1 model. So in this case, it's super simple to install Olama if you're going to be downloading these models locally. You can easily download the installer for your operating system. And then if you want to install any sort of model like the DeepSeek R1 distilled model, whatever size you would like, most likely 7B to 32B range, 
and you can simply copy the model card and then you can copy this go into your command prompt after you have olama running and then you can simply paste this in and install the DeepSeek r1 model so let's get started now i want you to first copy the git clone link to clone the repository and what you can do is open up your command prompt on your operating system and paste in this link and click enter this will clone the repo and then you can head over to the local site repository by typing in cd local site which will uh, then put you in within the directory and then you can install the dependencies with npm or yarn so simply paste this in within the directory and this will start installing everything that is necessary next you can open up your ide to configure the environment variables and to do this i'm opening up the local site directory within vs code which is a free ide that you can install to simply open up VS Code and click on open folder and find local site wherever you had cloned it. Then head over to the .env file, right click on it, click on rename and take out the .example and then you want to paste in your API keys. This is where you can set the API key for DeepSeek if you're going to be using the provider itself. Obviously, if you're going to be using Olama, you just need to change the local host so that it uses your local model. You can do the same for LM Studio, but in this case, I'm going to be using the DeepSeek API since I don't have the DeepSeek model installed via Olama. Make sure that for the default provider, you set it to whatever model that you're using. So in this case, if you're using the API key, make sure you set this as DeepSeek. If you're using Olama, then you obviously set it as Olama and self-explanatory for the other two. But once you have configured all of these environments, you can click on file and click save, and then you can close this. Afterwards, you just need to start your development server with the npm run dev command or the yarn dev command, and then it'll open up within your local host. So now I'm going to simply go ahead and copy the local host link and then open it up within my web browser. And you should be able to then access local host once it finishes starting up. And there we go. We now have it loading and we should be able to access the main dashboard. And there we go. Now we can use the DeepSeek model, the provider, and then use the two models, the DeepSeek V3 or the DeepSeek R1, which is now upgraded. So I'm going to select that. You can also add it so that there is a system prompt that uses more thinking, or you can add custom system prompts. We're just going to leave it as the default. You can also have the max output tokens configured. So now we can say something like generate or create me a SAS landing page that has a lot of features and we can then click on generate and you can see that right away it's going to work on executing this task by first initializing the model it's going to then create the steps to actually develop this SAS landing page for us you can actually get a live preview of it on the right hand side and the actual code being streamlined to you live in action so let's see what actually it generates And just like that, it has generated the code for us for our SAS landing page. You can view it on your laptop, a mobile device, as well as a computer screen. Now, what you can do is you can even export this. So right now, we're going to take a look at this in full screen mode. And you can see how beautiful the SAS landing page looks. And it did a pretty good job in terms of generating all the components for us. This was all done fully local with the help of our beautiful DeepSeek model powering our local site app. And say if you want to change something like adding a dark mode, you can simply go over to the new prompt and send in that actual prompt, which will then work on implementing that change to your overall code. And guys, the quality of output is truly insane. You can see that this is a SAS website that was fully generated with the help of DeepSight combined with the DeepSeek model. If you like this video and would love to support the channel, you can consider donating to my channel through the super thanks option below. Or you can consider joining our private discord where you can access multiple subscriptions to different AI tools for free on a monthly basis, plus daily AI news and exclusive content, plus a lot more. There's a lot of potential to this, so I highly recommend that you take a look at this with the links in the description below. But that's basically it guys for today's video on local site. This is a project that is still under development so there's going to be more features added over time but that is basically it guys thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed today's video make sure you take a look at all the links in the description below join our newsletter subscribe to the second channel if you haven't already subscribe and join to our patreon to join our discord follow me on twitter and lastly guys thank you guys so much for watching have an amazing day spread positivity subscribe to the youtube channel like this video and please take a look at our previous videos because there's a lot of content that you will truly benefit from 
But with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing day. Spare positivity, and I'll see you guys fairly shortly. Peace out, fellas.